Hey YouTube land, this is Redstorm Falls with my very first Transformers review video and my very first YouTube ever. Now today we are going to be looking at a Transformers Classics Generation Onslaught and my good friend Sean Teef is going to is going to talk about this and and I'll let him take it from here. What's up YouTube land? Alright, so this is going to be a custom for the Megatron and Fall of Cybertron. Here are some of the things I'm going to use. Screwdriver, screwdriver, screwdriver. So many screwdrivers. There's a lot of screwdrivers. And I'm going to use this gun. I'm going to unscrew his arm here and replace it with this. Now, Mason, I mean... Yeah, Mason. Redstorm Falls. Redstorm Falls. If you can give me the uh, Optimus behind you. Yes, sir. Now, this, now what I'm about to hand him is the Transformers War for Cybertron Optimus Prime. And now I will set it at He's, ground level. And he is bigger than the War for Cybertron by War for Cybertron Megatron. Not anymore. Look at that. That is a really big figure, guys. And I've heard that you can't buy this in stores anymore. The only way to really get this is to order it, order it online or something. Or you, there, I think there might be a new version with a different head sculpt and stuff. But uh, in some pictures, in his vehicle mode, I've seen him with like a ring. Kind of like this. Uh huh. I'm going to try and plug this in using the pictures I've seen. I'm going to plug it in to his leg, I guess. Like that. And it just folds in. And this is the shoulder piece to the Transformers animated um, love nut. So, yeah. For articulation, his head can go 360, his arms 360. He has this. He has. Well, you can kind of do that. This thing moves. His arm is like. can go 360. Bends at the elbow. Fist can go 360. And because of transformation, you can fold his fist in or do something like that mm -hmm. why not dare I say why not his legs can go like that Ratch on ratcheting joints and go in or out and back in bends at the knee has foot articulation and you can do this for the trans this is because of the transformation you can ha make him have toes Dare I say, why not? Now, Sean. Yes? Could you hold the camera, and may I hold him? Yeah. There you go, sir. Oh, sorry. This is a really, really good figure, guys. And I would recommend this to anybody who likes, well, Transformers. I mean, if you like Transformers, and you like the Combaticons, Onslaught is the way to go. And I really, really, really like the toes. I really think it's cool. And the detail on this is really phenomenal. They even got the bolts. Now, here's a gimmick from it. He has a button, and it makes him light up, makes light, that's a machine gun, and in the game, he has spikes, kind of, on his back. What I'm going to do for that is I'm going to unscrew these, cut these pieces here, and then super glue them onto the back. 
it's not gonna look exactly like the fall of Cybertron Megatron. Yeah. But it's gonna look pretty good. Yeah. And I can tell because the spikes are would look like Megatron. And to transform him, you basically fold his rotate his hands and fold them in. Then you're gonna take this now, whole section. I would like to ask us a question. Hmm? Would you recommend this? Like I said, recommend this to any Combaticon fan or yeah. any Transformer fan. Yeah, because I'm not certain, but I'm pretty sure there might be a way to make him into a Bruticus body. I don't know. I don't really care because I'm turning him into Megatron. Anyway, you bring this up, this PC fold down, then the arms, you rotate them. No. Wait. Yeah. Just bring them down, and they should connect into there. Like so. And then there's a peg, there's a hole. Connect it. We'll keep these bits down here. And then for the legs, you fold out the toe, bring these out. Now he is supposed to have a wheel, two wheels in here, Ooh, but since I'm using him for Megatron, I took them out. And you would just take, unfold this, bring that out for the wheel. So I can get that back in. And... Right in there, there was a hole. There were two pegs there. Mm -hmm. You peg one in. And one thing I forgot to mention is this back thing. Don't bring it all the way out. Just keep it like that. Then you do the thing with the leg. Peg it in. Do the same thing on this side. Peg it in. If I can get Sorry, it. guys. This is a pain to plug in. There. Now you're going to fold this in a little. Like that. It looks a little better. Or you can just have it like that. I think it looks better like this. And you come on to the back. You keep you fold these back out. Bring this all the way down. And on the sides there are two small ish pegs. Inside the legs there are um holes. You just plug it in like that. Fold these back. And the real holes that are missing, they would be right here. But like I said, it's Megatron. And for right now, I'm just having these things stay out. And I'm not really sure what I'm going to do with the gun yet. But, and this thing can move as well. And if you really wanted, awesome. if you really wanted to, you, this is on the tires here. There's a black line. That's basically what it's for, making some kind of noise. And you compare that to Optimus Still. Still a really big vehicle form. Long ways. Now it's about the same size. Not really. Kind of. And here he is next to the fall of Cybertron Optimus. Those are some dogs that are in the house. Yeah, sorry about those guys. That guys. I have a Great Dane, a Whippet, Slash Boxer, and all of those. Great Dane. It's painful. 
Now, here he, here's the ball of Cybertron Optimus. Now, do you want me to transform him in vehicle? Now he's even shorter. Now, do you want me to transform him in vehicle form to see how the comparison with that? They can. All right, there might be another video that uh, my friend will do. Who so? We're not really going to show it on the camera. Sorry about the guys. A person has arrived at the house and they will not stop unless I go out there and beat their... Don't want to finish that. You don't really beat them. You just tap them on the nose and they be quiet. No, but they will bark all night. And so here is the vehicle form. As you can see, so much shorter. Do this. Yeah. Yeah, so... Fall Cybertron Optimus doesn't have much on and, Onslaught. And why not? I'm going to bring the Fall of Cybertron uh, Brawl in. If I can get this angled right. Mason? Yes? Now, Brawl is kind of big, but... I think that scales nicely. Yeah. I think his guns make him more taller. Yeah, they do. So. Yeah. So. Remember uh, um, to subscribe to my friend. Red Strong Falling. And leave a like and subscribe for more Transformers Fall Cybertron reviews. And don't toy forget. Toy reviews. And possibly... That big boy over there. That might happen. You never know. So, subscribe, and see you next time. And subscribe to my channel. It is Sean, Sean T. T. With T-E-I-F. His father spelled it wrong. Yes, he did. And we'll see you guys later. Bye.